Herrera had just turned 18 three months before he was killed. Now his mother, who is still in mourning, is taking her grief and she says turning it into something beautiful that can also help the community. I'm still dealing with my grief and, and, and trying to honor my son's memory at the same time. Anna Ramos and her son loved the outdoors, from hiking to camping and swimming. He would climb up on trees on swing sets and hey mom and he'd jump off. Ramos said that his thrill for life was contagious. I had no fear because he knew I was the one fearing for him. Herrera was in a hit and run on November 20th. When he got out of his car, he was struck by another driver. That driver did not stop and Herrera lost his life. Who, who plans for their kid to go first? This totally caught us off, off guard. Knowing how much her son loved the outdoors, Ramos started Project Clean Up Austin Trails. The group goes and cleans up trash and garbage that people have left out on different trails. Why would you want to trash a place like this? Be respectful. It's our job to take care of nature. Because Mother Nature, Mother Nature can't take care of uh, herself. She says by doing this, she can not only give back to the community by helping out, but bring awareness to driver and pedestrian safety. This makes me feel better because I know I'm doing it to honor my son. I want him to be proud of me. Now there is a GoFundMe for the family and any costs they may be facing. We'll put a link to that in this story on our website. Reporting to you in North Austin, Casey Bowen, Fox 7 Austin News.